Hey guys, it's me. Um, well, this video is about how to get your t sexy tan self on without going out in the sun or getting skin cancer and all that bad stuff. But first off, did I see that? No, okay, whatever. But um, I want to show you guys one of my newest products that I got. Um, it's Mineral Fusion. That's the company I guess in um, cosmetics, and it's uh, the hydration mist. It works really good. Um, you just spray it on your skin, just like three times, like one, two, three. And um, what it does is it hydrates your skin when you need it, and it works really good. It makes your skin super smooth. I highly recommend it. It's fairly like it's like really expensive for this bottle. It costs about twenty bucks. But it's worth it. Trust me, it's worth it. And yeah, so it's highly recommended. Whoop. Yeah. And my friend, Kayla, she wanted me to do a video because she's like on vacation right now and she's not with me. But, anyways, um, she wanted me to do a video on how to get a tan because she's out in Alaska. Yeah. Um, so she wanted to know how to get a tan without having to go outside, obviously. She doesn't want to go outside. Or to a tanning place. That, and she wants it cheap. So, um, I use this stuff. It's a True Blue Spa by, uh, Bath and Body Works. That's where you can get it. It's vitamin E. It has vitamin E in it. Um, it says, uh, Bronzing Self Tanning Lotion. It's Strike Gold. Yeah, um, it costs $15, so it's not that expensive. Okay, what you want to do first is you want to take a good kind of lotion and just rub it on your hands. That's what I always do so my hands don't turn out like really nasty looking. Okay, second of all, when you're doing this, you want to take the lotion, like, not, not the like hand lotion or whatever. You want to take this. And what you want to do is you're going to take, like, let's say I'm doing my arm. I'm going to take it and put little dots all over my arm. Like, all over it. Just like, I say about 10 dots on your arm. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take your arm and you're going to rub it in circular motions into your skin. All the way up your arm. And make sure you don't miss any spots. Okay, and then you're going to do that to your other arm. And then what you want to do for your body, your torso, is you're going to want to take it and, like, do dot, 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 and then just, like, keep on dotting up your body. And you're going to take that and you're just going to rub it in circular motions. Make sure you get, like, a little bit on your neck. Just a little bit. And then, what you're going to do for your legs is basically the same exact thing all over again. Make sure you miss no spots at all, because trust me, you'll look like a clown. And, um, also, just a suggestion, what people usually do sometimes is they take, like, um, I was looking to see if I had something, but I probably won't. Hold on. No, I don't. But, um... What they usually do, like most people, they take like like a little sticker or something. Like I use this little star that like, you know, like you stick onto your ceilings that glow in the dark at night. Yeah. I take one of those and I stick it onto like my waist or something. Like somewhere like not noticeable really, but um cute. And I stick it there and I make sure like I don't get any tanning on that. And um when I'm done tanning like, you can see how tan you got. Like, I know that's really popular. So that's what I do. Because, yeah. Um, also, uh, you leave, make sure you do not exercise or take showers within three or four hours that you did this. Because if you do, it's not going to come out and it's just not going to work. And it really, it's just a waste of your time just to even try it and then go swimming or, like, go exercising or take a shower. After like three or four hours after you like before you've done this because it just washes off and it doesn't do anything to your skin What you want to do for your face is you want to take just um, This and do one 
two, three, one, two, three. And then you want to take one on your nose right here and two on, like two little ones on the side. And you're just going to rub that into your face. You don't want to put as much on your face as you did on your rest of your body because your face is going to turn out really, really orange. Trust me, I know. I've done it the first time I did this. Um, and then what you want to do for your back. Okay, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah, okay. So about the back thing, sorry. I got a text message, so I had to stop. But um, about the back thing, you want somebody to do the back for you because otherwise you're going to miss spots. So if you can, have somebody else do it for you. Um, also, I forgot to do the forehead part. Yeah, you want to obviously get your forehead. Um, and then you're going to take a little bit of this, rub it on your hands, and just like rub it into your neck. You don't want to put it on your neck because I don't know why, but it just doesn't work out as good if you put it on your neck first. Yeah, so yeah. Make sure you do all those steps, and then after that, you're going to want to put on loose, baggy clothes, and, um, yeah. Make sure you don't wear tight-fitting clothes, or, like, try to, like, put on crappy clothes that you don't really like anymore. Like, if you're going to go paint something, put on those kind of clothes, because if you put on, like, nice clothes, um, chance, chances are is that the tanning lotion is going to come off on those clothes and probably stain your clothes. So, yeah, probably not the best idea if you wear good clothes. Um, yeah, so that's what I do. I'm about to do it right now because I'm going out tomorrow and I want to look fresh. Yeah, so, yeah, I'm bored. What happens if I press this button? <laughs> it's like one of those reset buttons. What does this do? <laughs> That's so much fun! <laughs> yeah. Okay, make sure you add, rate, subscribe, request videos. Oh my god! You guys have been so amazing at that lately. It makes me so happy. Yeah, so make sure you request videos. Cause I get bored because I have a lot of free time. Not really. But yeah, I'll make the videos if you request them. So make sure to request them. It makes me a happy person. And if I'm not happy, I'll do something really extremely weird that doesn't make anybody else happy. So yeah, make sure you request videos. Oh my god, I have the funniest story ever. But my sister would hate me if I told everybody. Because she watches all my videos and comments on them. And she would hate me if I told you guys. <laughs> yeah. Adios amigos or amigas, whichever one you prefer. Yeah.